I have five children and every one of them is different. It's amazing that my wife and I could have five children and they'd be so different. We love all of them the same and they love us, but each is different. Not one of them is superior to the other. Each has their own aptitudes and their own gifts. The Bible says God is no respecter of persons. In His sight, everybody's of equal value, but everybody is different. And you know, many times fathers make the mistake of trying to get their sons to be just like them, to think and to dress and to be like them. Don't try too hard to get your boy to be just like you. Give your children their own identity. Let them make their own decisions concerning Christ. Influence them, yes. Guide them, yes. Teach them, yes. But remember, they are different than you. They have their own aptitudes, their own gifts that may be superior to yours. And when it comes to spiritual things, you can lead them so far, take them to church, yes. And up until a certain point in their lives, make them go. I'll tell you, there was a many a Sunday I didn't want to go, but I was told to go. And I went. And I'm glad that I was told to go. But when I reached a certain age, I suppose, I won't tell you the age, but it was a certain age. My parents made the wise decision to allow me to make my own decision. Because there comes a time when you're an adult and God holds you responsible as an adult. And you must make your own decision concerning Jesus Christ. You cannot inherit your faith.